manualtherapist.com and physioanswers.com and I just wanted to shoot a quick video of how to shovel uh, correctly with good body mechanics. As you can see, I shoveled all of this myself. Uh, oh, don't get that snowblower in the uh, shot. Okay, so anyway, you could, uh, you could strain a, a lot from, you know, the repetition and the exertion. Um, so there's a couple tips on how to prevent injury with uh, shoveling. So the first thing you want to do is, is make it like a more of a workout and you don't want to use your back, you want to use your legs, all right? So you, you want to lunge into it because you want your leg, your leg is designed to accept weight, not your back. You don't want to shovel like this. You want to lunge in. This snow is really heavy. <laughs> Get underneath the shovel, use a good long lever arm, lift up. Then whenever you go to throw it, you want to pivot on your outside leg, not your inside leg. You pivot on your inside leg, there's a lot less room for internal rotation on the inside leg rather than the outside leg has a lot more external rotation. So you can just contract, blow out, make your belly nice and tight, and throw like that. So I didn't really twist my body, I, I externally rotated on this hip. All right, so you want to lunge, lift, and throw. The other thing you really want to do is to get minimize too much uh, excessive strain. You want to introduce a little variability. So you want to throw, you know, maybe every five or six scoops. You want to you want to use the other side. So you want to lunge, lift, and I'm not going to throw right into my wife. Throw. <laughs> throw. That was the great body mechanics. Now again. You're probably going to bend a little bit more than you want to, so just to spare your back a little bit, you want to introduce a little extension. So my favorite thing to do is just go into quadruped. And slowly tilt your head back, and uh, you might feel a little strain in the low back. When that's gone, with about three or four, five or six diaphragmatic breaths, and the front of your hips are finally touching the ground, that's when it's okay to resume your repetitive activity. So stay safe and uh, wish me luck in digging out. 